Lesson 102, Growth and Decay. When something's growing, it's getting bigger. So we're adding to it. If something's decaying, it's getting smaller. So when we have growth, it looks like on a graph that it's gonna be getting bigger. If we're having decay, it's getting smaller, it will look more like that. So growth is when you are um, maybe multiplying by a number. So if we go from 1 to 2, then to 4, to 8, to 16, and so on, this is growth, it's getting bigger, and we're timesing by 2. The constant ratio, which is 2, is always going to be greater than 1. It has to be greater than 1 in order to continue to get bigger. For decay, whoops, it's something that's getting smaller, so we're going to be multiplying by a number between 0 and 1. So let's try this one, 64. 32, 16, 8, 4, 2, and so on. So if you notice, we're timesing by 1 half. So we times by 1 half. So our constant ratio is a fraction between 0 and 1. So it's got to be um, greater than 0 and less than 1. So here's an example. We have a population Oops. of a particular place grows 2% per year. Uh, the current population is 1,200,000. What will the population be in three years? before the E and the A. That is so strange. Okay, what will it be in three years? Well, the first year, if I take my uh, original population, so after one year, I'm going to times it by 1.02. That means the 1 is 100%, so it'll, it'll have the million uh, point two, and then we're going to add 2%, which is 0 0.02. So we're going to just times by 1.02. We get 1,224,000. That's after the first year. Then after the second year, we take that amount and times it by 1.02. And we get 1,248,480. Then after the third year, which is what we want to know, we take one million two hundred forty eight thousand four hundred eighty and times it by one and two hundredths and we get one million two hundred seventy three thousand four hundred forty nine point six so we will have approximately one million two hundred seventy three thousand people we just rounded to the nearest thousands and B how long will it take to double We have a really cool thing that we can do to see when a population doubles. And it's called the rule of 72. It's pretty awesome. So you do 72 divided by the growth rate. And that equals how long until whoops, the population doubles. So we just take 72, our growth rate is 2%, divided by 2, so in 36 years, the population will double. Isn't that so awesome? Okay, that's the end of the lesson.